Good afternoon, everybody. I would like to share with you a paradox and then a solution to that paradox that we have found. Uh, my name is Mahmoud and I am the CEO of Innova Radio. Uh, the paradox is that we have a good news, a bright side, and also a dark side. The bright side is that uh, mobile telecommunications have revolutionized the way we live in all aspects. And we have reached in last year 7.4 billion connected mobile devices, and it is going to grow to 26 billion uh, by 2020. Uh, we can now download at high speed a movie in 40 seconds uh, and have the benefits of online movies all the time. But <laughs> you are right at, at, at the best tests. Uh, the dark side of this is that this is costing us more energy consumption, more CO2, more pollution. Every additional G that we have is less efficient in energy, and therefore it consumes more energy than the previous G, because it puts more data in less space, in the same amount of space. There is also the extreme growth of the whole network. We are going to be installing next year about two million base stations in the world together. Now, who's the culprit for this uh, problem that we are having? The culprit is what we call base stations. Usually we see the outer part, which is the antenna, but in reality, inside, there is a piece of equipment, which is the transmitter. Now, the problem is with how the transmitter works. Jeff? A transmitter, no, put it up, all up, okay. A transmitter today works with all lights on all the time. Full power, 50 volts, constant. Now, and this is the old way of doing things. In order to transmit, we light up almost the whole building. What we do is to turn on the lights only where it is necessary. We call it power on demand. The transmitter, once it is equipped with our technology, will no more consume constant energy, but only energy according to its needs. Now, uh, our customers are the manufacturers of those transmitters. There are five basically in the world. We all know their names, Ericsson, Nokia Alcatel, Huawei, ZTE, and Samsung. These people provide the equipment for the base stations, for the transmitters, for the mobile operators. Now, using our technology, these devices will become more efficient and consume one third less energy. One third less energy consumed by a transmitter as a result of the implementation of Innova Radio's technology within the equipment. One of the benefits of one of those manufacturers using our technology is that immediately we have a global ramp up. The smallest of the, those has a 10% global market share. The larger ones, 22 to 25%. As soon as that technology is adopted by one of them, we are reaching the whole world. Now, using this technology has several benefits. Several stakeholders will benefit from it. The environment first, probably, I put it first because we are in a clean tech environment. So the environment will benefit to the tune of the potential, obviously, of this technology being adopted everywhere, is taking off two and a half million to four million cars off the road, and uh, 12 to 18 megatons of CO2, more or less, the production of a country like Bolivia or Estonia. For the mobile operators, the benefit is saving between two to three billion dollars of their annual energy spending. And for the investor, a uh, nice return on the investment. We will talk about that afterwards when you come and see me. Uh, we have achieved so far, raised, we have raised 2.6 million. The first prototype has been successfully developed and tested. Potential customer identified with an MOU. And the next step is to build the prototype of the second generation and for this, we are asking 700,000 pounds. Thank you very much.